says Team 10 could have been bigger than the Kardashians in a new video. Plus, KSI reveals what he's been doing to prepare for his August 25th fight. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life, and recall Jake Paul slapped Deji across the face. Well, Deji released a video saying since he and KSI were doing public training sessions, he thought it would be funny to stop by Jake's, and he also reveals Greg Paul got hit as well. Well, anyway, to KSI, he was spotted training in Manchester, and just look at the hands on this guy. But all right, remember how Bradley Martin got punched by Jake and Logan Paul to see how hard they could hit? Oh, that last one. Oh, that was good. Ooh. Oh, that was good. Well, Bradley finally got KSI to do the same thing so he could compare. And while he wouldn't say at the moment who hits the hardest, I think the answer's written all over his face. Let's go. Oh, it's all right? No, yeah. Okay. It's good, it's good. Okay. Yeah, I just want to tell them. I want to tell them so <laughs> bad. I'm having a hard time clicking my mouth. I'm trying to think of an intelligent question right now. But all right, the most interesting part of Bradley's video might be KSI revealing what he's been doing to prepare for this fight. I do a lot of chess, connect for like, play roots. You're talking about like, playing like yeah, games. Yeah, yeah, actual games. Because boxing is all about this. On to Jake Paul, he recently spoke to True. True. And revealed why he thinks Deji needed this fight. He also says like. Like a lot. Even when he like went back to the UK and like sat down and like ma made his video like saying that he would fight me, like I was like surprised. I was like, what? Like, why? Why do this? And I tried to like put all of the clues together. And to me, like the only thing that I can get out of it is like this is just like a chance for him to like revive like his brand and like his career and like his YouTube channel. Jake also opens up about friends he's known forever who just ditched him after all the drama he went through and it's a bit emotional. Literally kids who I've been best friends with since like seventh grade wake up and are like, oh, there's a moving truck here, like peace out. And they're not even like adult enough to like have a conversation with me about it. It's like, it's such a, mind like cluster. I've never been through something like so crazy. I'm not crying, you're crying, stop. <laughs> but all right, Jake also reveals at one point he thinks Team 10 could have been bigger than the Kardashians and they talk butt stuff, sort of. I think if you think about it, if Team 10 were together right now, it would be the, we'd be bigger than the Kardashians. I don't know if your ass is as good as Kim's, to be honest with you, but we'll find no, out. No, I know, but... <laughs> it might be. <laughs> yeah, but... But all right, guys, if you think Jake has a bigger butt than a Kardashian, click right up here to subscribe and smash that like button for all the latest. Bye, guys.